What's up everybody? Welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today I'm going to show you five simple science experiments. Let's check this out. For the first experiment, this is a flying wish paper. That's so funny. This is actually a cool science experiment you can make out of a tea bag but that's kind of cool that they did a wish paper. You fold it up, write something and then you make a wish but it's also a really cool science experiment. So all I have to do is kind of fold it up this paper and stand it like this and let's light it and see what happens. At first it doesn't fly but after a while when it's almost starting to burn off boom look at it it takes off please kids do not play with fire make sure you have adult supervision okay you light it up it's starting to burn and in a minute it is going to start to fly up because heat arises and it's light enough for the ash to fly up boom for this science experiment we got here a big magnet and six small magnets and we're going to grab another big magnet right here let's see what happened when we push these magnets close to this magnet. ah that actually hurted my finger a little bit that was a fail this is why safety is number one priority if i push it everybody knows it's going to push it away now we're going to grab this magnet and flip it upside down boom and look at it this magnet is attracts and it also follows but how come they're not just touching each other it's so cool and it's so weird let me show you even closer as you can see this magnet want to attract to each other but the smaller magnets are pushing this magnet away and that way that magnet is just stuck just following like few millimeters from each other so weird and so cool i love that science toy and if if i go like this look it just follows it and if i lift it a little bit boom it can attract here's another science experiment set there's a ball bearings none of them is a magnetic and this one right here is a neodymium magnet so what we're going to do is set neodymium magnet into here let me zoom in a little bit then we're going to put ball bearings like this and look when we put it together nothing really happens and then i'm going to get the last ball bearing and just drop it into here boom whoa did you see that let's try to do this again let me show you how fast it flies away boom you see it's uh, flies across the table this is what this experiment called i can't pronounce this four bearings right now and one bearing right here boom whoa do you see how fast it shoot off now let's do the same thing with three bearings whoa that's pretty fast too let's try the same thing with two bearings see if it's going to shoot off anyways wow fast as well now let's do the same thing but just just one bearing nothing happens so what actually happening even though we're dropping this little ball bearing so gently we almost cannot see that this ball actually right here really speeds up and hits near the magnet and that's why it flies out really hard to actually see it with the naked eye but if we bring the ball closer to here do you see that that little hit what makes that ball fly out so fast I come across another really cool science toy. I've done this before. It's a neodymium magnet and a copper pipe, but this one is way cooler. Before I would have to show it to you from the top of the pipe, but look, there is actually a window, so we will be able to see through. You see it right here? Neodymium magnet flying down or falling down slowly. Well, we can now open this up. As you can see, one is a neodymium magnet right here. And the other one is just the same weight, but it's not neodymium magnet. It's just a piece of metal. So now, what happens if I drop non-magnet? Boom, do you see how fast it falls too? Wow. Now, this is the magnet. Let's see what happens if I drop it in this copper pipe. Wow, you see how slow this is? Let me know in comments below why does this happens. 
I love this science toy because you can actually can see on a side what actually happening. You don't have to try to see it from the top of the pipe. So it makes it a really cool demonstration. Neodium magnet, non neodium magnet. Wow. And one more really cool science toy. You spin it. Oh, fail. Let's try this again. Oh, that's a good one. Isn't it cool? Look at that. It's kind of hollow inside and they stick this way. That's how you spin it right here and boom, it stands up. How cool is that? Oh, that's a good one right there. Wow. Why does that happen? Why does it turns around and flips upside down and stands up on one layer stick? So cool, isn't it?